What's going on everyone? Welcome back to our Buffalo Sabres franchise mode and we are getting up to our home opener in which we still do have that goal of winning our home opener. It is a secondary goal set by our owner, but it's one that I want to, to make sure that happens because not only is this our home opener, this is going to be a game against Jack Eichel in which we just traded away Jack Eichel, all right? Remember that trade earlier in the preseason? It's going to be interesting game number one of the season going right up against him. I want to go over some free agent signings or at least show you guys some of these free agent signings before we do hop into the regular seasons as well. Um, I'm not going to be really going over the names. I just wanted to show you them. There's some interesting ones. Uh, Mark Jonah uh, Chanikowski going to Arizona. All right, Michael Grabner to Nashville. Nikita Gusev going to Anaheim. Brady Tuchuk re-signing with Ottawa. Just one year deal though. Tuka Rask going to Columbus. Yeah, that'll be that'll be fun for sure. Over there in Columbus, getting themselves a much better goaltender. Probably not going to be the greatest in the long term, um, but he's going to give Columbus that that playoff shot right now. Um, now I did see a comment. I did see a comment. He told me in, in the first episode, well, technically episode zero, uh, about the budget issue. And I, I thought that the budget, um, I, I thought the budget would just auto allocate some more money for me there. And I wouldn't have any issue. Unfortunately, the, the having it on auto didn't do that for me. Um, so I had to manually go in. I manually went in. I gave myself some more uh, some more salary here. No more coaching salary to be able to afford Amy Gomez. So she still officially now is our AHL goalie coach now that I allocated more budget to the coaching budget. Um, but now that we're not going to be hiring anymore or any more coaches or sending scouts anywhere, I took all the money away from that, all the money away from the scout travel, from this coaching budget. I put it all into advertisement. There's no more promotions because we already did the auto promotions uh, a little bit ago. And then I, I added the rest into arena operations and I have arena maintenance on auto. I'm, I really don't want to deal with it. I really didn't even want to deal with this part of it. But, you know, if, if I have to, it's not like it's going to be that big of a deal. So that's what we're doing. So we're saving it right there. Uh, let's see. Let's go over the owner over goals again. So, yep. Win our regular season home opener. We'll get 30K of bonus cash. We need to boost our team chemistry from 5 to 73. I think that that will be possible. I don't know how the fuck this team is at five chemistry. Probably because it's just a disgruntled organization and really needs an overhaul right now. Um, and then the expected profits. I I don't really understand how to get profitable besides winning games. So hopefully we do wind up getting our primary goal. Um, uh, let's go over the roster. So another thing. I did put it in the comment uh, in the video last time. I forgot to put Josh Anderson up from the AHL. He is now officially on our roster. I have him on the second line with Cousins and Skinner. And I think I have him on the power play. Yep, I got him on the first line power play as well with Galchenyuk and Olafson. So that will be fun. Jeff Skinner down on the second with Cousins and Svechi. All right, so that is that is about it. I also put Anderson on like our our uh, if it goes into overtime for three on three play and the start of the four on four. I have him in there um, as well. I want to start this episode though going over to contract extension. Yep, 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 yep. Um, going over to contract extensions. I want to extend this goaltender Lukanen. Uh, still medium elite. 78 overall, this guy is 100% going to be ready to play in the NHL, possibly even this season. Um, but I want to groom him for his his backup role next year. Maybe he even grows to being a starter for next year. Lukanen, for sure, though, going to be playing in the NHL next year. Yeah, he even wants that payday. Holy shit. Uh, we'll do three years at three. Yeah, we'll do three six. We'll do 3-6 for him. Three years at 3-6. We'll keep him in that restricted free agent territory. I think that will work. Um, and everyone else here. I mean, I could go for Colin Miller. 3-8. Oh, he actually wants to take a pay decrease to stay with the team. 
All right, yeah, two years. Two years at that, I'll do it. You're taking a pretty sizable fucking pay decrease to stay here, so I'll do it. I'll do it. 2-6 for Colin Miller. Oh, nice, nice. Not bad at all. So let's get into a quick sim for our AHL squad. AHL squad I also did edit the lines. I didn't edit the power play or anything, um, but they didn't want to put Linus Anderson uh, in on that fourth line, even though it says, you know, minor fourth line player. He's got that top six potential. I need this motherfucker to grow. All right, I want Linus Anderson to grow. So we're putting him on that fourth line at least until I have him a little bit more scouted. All right, another guy that they, they auto took out for whatever reason was Lukanen. It's very weird that they took Lukanen out and they were going to play Tokarski and uh, Craig Anderson as our, our, our net mining duo. But I want to go with Lukanen and Bibeline. And Bibeline now down to a fringe starter. I don't care. Man, I really don't. Goaltenders are going to get hurt and it's going to cause me to have to send players up and down, anyways. So Craig Anderson probably going to get some game time, probably going to decrease a lot here, but whatever. He was going to be our first call up if there is an injury to our goaltenders in the NHL. Dustin Dukarski is just going to be a sub player um, for our AHL. And if there is another injury in the NHL, um, once Craig Anderson does get called up again, we'll just call Tukarski up and he'll be our, our like fourth string NHL goaltender. Um, but let's get into game number one up against the Utica Comets. See how this is going to go. Quick sim it. So period number, and uh, we'll slow sim. We'll slow sim. Power play, nothing. Power play for us, nothing again. There we go, DeLeo scored. Oh, wait, no, we fucking scored. We got scored on. No, fuck you, DeLeo. Fuck you. How dare you score on us? Oh, all right. That's two goals against. God damn it. God damn it. There you go. Kyle Acapozo. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. I forgot about that. I did send Kyle Acapozo down to the AHL. 77 overall. He's making $6 million. Probably should be playing in the AHL. But I want him to kind of prove it down in the AHL because of Josh Anderson. And I don't want to send down anybody else who's already playing on us. So Kyle Acapozo, kind of that odd man out, sent him down to the minors. Completely forgot about that. That's another guy that I wish I didn't have to send down, John Hayden. But again, just we did we just had too many players. We had too many forwards. Had to send him down. Nice to see that he is paying dividends down there in the AHL. So two two game now a four two game as we choked away in the final two minutes of the seconds. Shots are twenty three twenty. Come on, Rochester, let's get back on track here. Let's get back on track. Come on. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Come on. Come on, do it. All right, not that's going to happen. So we wind up losing our first AHL game 4-2. to two. A little disappointed. Actually, extremely disappointing. Um, there, Kyle Capozo, two points, though. Kind of trying to show everyone, hey, I should be up in the NHL. And maybe if our team doesn't do too hot up here, maybe we do make some line changes and call up Acapozo. Who knows? You know, changes happen all the time. But it's time for our home opener, boys. It's time for our home opener. And you know how we do things here? We are not going to be playing CPU versus CPU. Look at that. Fucking Jack Eichel, 91 overall, X-Factor, lining up with Carey Price, another X-Factor. Jeff Petrie got that superstar ability, and then you look over here, and we got nothing. We got nothing. But that's okay. That's going to be completely fine. Hopefully, we wind up... Uh... All right, I think there's like a little glitch here because I don't see any jerseys, but whatever. Um, let's just jump on into this game, see how things are going to go. All right, here we go. Face off number one. Eichel winning it. Why to Toffoli? So starting off, Buffalo's on defense. Galchenyuk 
being pinned on the border or on, in the corner. Darlene with it. Come on, let's let's get out of whatever type of screen that was. Olaf's in toe drags coming on in. Shot rebound out front. Nobody able to get there in time. Darlene curls up the boards. Over to Svechnikov. Svechnikov wide to Miller. Miller to Galchenyuk. Galchenyuk to Olafsson. Olafsson cuts out front. Shot. Rebound again. Carey Price giving up the rebounds. Tisk, 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 Price. Tisk, tisk, tisk. Let's go here. Come on. Losing the face off again, Edmondson. Over to the Foley. The Foley gets hit. Still getting it though. Still looking for someone to Foley hit again. Out front Gallagher. One tees it right into the chest of Jake Allen. See now Jake Allen, he knows this Canadian offense and their defense. He he just got traded two weeks ago. He he knows it. He knows them a little bit. Hopefully that'll be like an advantage for us. Cousins, wide to Josh Anderson, Anderson two on one, oh he tries to go cross crease to Skinner, no good, Skinner behind the net, getting out front shot, Cousins now behind the net, passing it out front to Skinner, hits the net, no good there, doesn't connect, Hoffman hit along the boards, to Cousins, oh my god, Cousins to Pissick, Pissick to Butcher, Butcher to Jeff Skinner again, Skinner passing it wide to Anderson, Anderson looking for a shot, Goes high blocker, nice save by Carey Price. Anderson back with it, up top to his defenseman, over to Cousins out front, backhand, rebound to himself, a blocker save by Price. This Buffalo offense is really swinging. They got that momentum happening right now, and they had a penalty too. Looks like we're going to get a shot to see Buffalo's uh, power play here. Shea Weber interference call. I wish my screen would stop. Getting all blurry. I don't know if you guys can see that blurriness here, but I sure the fuck can. I don't like it. It should get fixed once uh, once the game actually gets released. I have to do this on the Xbox app to try to record it. So I'm hoping that that's just the issue and uh, we can get that fixed once the game actually comes out. Because whatever we reason, I can't stream it on Twitch. It says that this game is unstreamable. So that's usually how I record it. So let's see. Anderson up to middle stat. Over to Olafson. Shot. Tip. Goes wide. Darlene down in the corner. Up to Anderson. Out front to Galchenyuk. Shot. Save. Savard now going to dump it. Down. Darlene settles it. Over to Galchenyuk. Galchenyuk to Anderson. Anderson to Olafson. Olafson. Toe drag. Anderson not able to corral the puck. Olafson. Shot. No good. Savard. Galchenyuk. Olafson. Battling for the puck, Savard still with it. Passing to Petrie, now goes down the length of the ice. Darlene to Anderson. Anderson wide to Cousins. Cousins coming on in, trying to get a shot. No good, dumped again by Montreal. Holy shit. This is like early 2000s like graphics right now. Like trying to watch some early 2000 hockey, just super fucking blurry. There, I mean, you get some clean shots, but like for the most part, it's so blurry right now. I hate it. Svechnikov to Darlene. Darlene making a move, still with it. He's getting chased by two, tries to force a pass out front. No good. Byron gets destroyed by Cousins. And he picks up that puck again. Sherratt able to dump it down. 20 seconds remaining on the power play. And it looks like we're kind of... Uh, Kind of not looking too good. Like, we're trying to, like, force the shot, not trying to set things up. Yeah, right there. Svechnikov again with it. Toe drag out front. No good. Dvorak dumping it down the length of the ice, and now we're back to some five-on-five five hockey. Middle stat to Cousins. Cousins still with it. He gets obliterated, but he does get the puck out of the zone at least. Edmondson to Savard. Savard to Caulfield. Caulfield gets hit. <clears throat> Middle stat. Over to Darlene. Darlene to Cousins. Cousins, slow, slow, no good. Wide to Hoffman. Hoffman over to Savard. 
Spar coming down out front. Middlestat intercepts it. Cousins again with Hoffman out front. Caulfield shot wide. And Jake Allen's now going to poke that one away from Caulfield when he's just sitting there and cover it up for a defensive zone faceoff for Buffalo. All right. They don't have a right winger out to Foley, Eichel, and that's it. Savard out front shot, blocked and swatted down the length of the ice. Not going to be an icing call. Kulik going to curl out in the corner, still with it. Passing up to Eichel. Eichel trying to pass it out front to Gallagher. He mishandles it, but still gets it. Passing to Kulik. Now to Toffoli. Toffoli, stick lifted. Tag Thompson. Now coming. Slowed into the zone, looking for something. Up top to Butcher. Wide to Bjork. Back to Thompson. Thompson up to Butcher. Butcher over to Bjork. Bjork shot wide over to Thompson. Shot taken away by Kulik. Not quick enough on that shot there. Kulik to Toffoli. Toffoli glove down by Allen. Nice. Nice. Mm -hmm. Come on. Win this face off, boys. Eichel wins it. Sherratt. Slap shot wide. Eichel up to Weber. Weber gets hit to Foley to Eichel. Eichel gets poked and Sherratt trying to keep it on sides, but it barely goes out of the zone. As now this is going to be still on Buffalo's side, but at least it's offside. It's going to give them a little bit more space. Our first line against theirs now. Galchenyuk. Taking the face off, losing it. Svechi. Going in, Toei. Toei again. Svechnikov still with it. Backhand wide. Galchenyuk. Over to Svechnikov. Shot wide again. Olison. In the corner, pinned. Up to Butcher. Butcher trying to get it down low. No good. Caulfield and Eichel now trying to go the other way. Big hit on Caulfield. Hang to Olofsson. Olofsson to Galchenyuk. Elchenyuk losing it to Weber. Weber over to Caulfield. Caulfield gets hit, losing it to Galchenyuk again. Trying to skate it in. Cuts to the center of the ice. Olofsson to Hag. Hag! Slap shot. Glove down for an easy save by Mr. Gary Price. Buffalo's offense, man. Our offense seems really good. Like 10 to 2 in shots, man. We're, we got that chemistry. We're really rolling here. Maybe we can su surprise some people. It is early, so you don't you don't want to jump the gun. Asplund, middle stat, out front, shoot the fucking puck. Holy shit, middle stat. That's why you're a 77 overall in this game. Middle stat over to Bjork. Bjork losing it. Jonathan drew in, pinned all along the boards. Middle stat now pinned, pucks loose. Christian Dvorak skating it on up. Boom, 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 boom. Just in the corner out front. Yokoharu going to intercept that. Bjork now. Still gaining some time. Dumps it on into the zone. Dump and chase. Petrie pinned behind the net. He's going to throw it wide for Druin. Druin gets hit. Uh-oh. Loose puck. Petrie trying to get it. No good. But that is it for the end of the period. No offense really being able to get in the end there. Some big hits, though. Some big fucking hits. Some good scoring opportunities right there. There's some loose pucks, man. Carey Price is having a hard time right now, really corralling that puck on the initial shot. Oh, my God. It was right there. Did you see that highlight? Oh, it was right on the red line. Their defense fucking bailed him out. Oh, okay. Getting on into period number two now. Galchenyuk lined up with Eichel. Eichel's been winning just about every faceoff. Galchenyuk finally wins one, though. Miller over to Olofsson. Olofsson to the center. Shot save. Man, Olofsson is going to be so fucking good for us. Defoli picked off by Darlene. Oh, Darlene's such a good defender, too. We're already able to notice his like, good play compared to everybody else. Edmondson over to Eichel. Eichel to Toffoli. Toffoli on a breakaway. And Jake Allen able to stand out front and make the save. Passing Dalene now to Svechnikov. Svechnikov makes a move. Trying to create some space down low. Olofsson by the net to Galchenyuk. Galchenyuk over to Miller. Miller cutting to the middle over to Galchenyuk. Yeah, man, no one wants to shoot the puck. 
Petrie to Eichel. Come on. Eichel to Gallagher. Gallagher makes a move. Curls, trying to find someone. Hits off the wrong Montreal Canadian in an interception. Colin Miller for Buffalo. Skating, creating some time. Cuts to the middle. Center ice. Glove save by Carey Price. Oh, he could have done that little uh, backdoor tap-in. Cut to the middle. Goaltender comes out to try to play you. And you just hit the guy coming wide because the goaltender doesn't see him. That could have been a nice play, but it is what it is. Montreal wins it. Weber coming on up. Poked. Caulfield still able to get it, though. Up top to Sherratt. Sherratt. Shot is wide. Skinner with, got it for Buffalo now. Skinner looking for a bounce back season. He had a very good preseason. Now let's see if he, that can correlate into something here in the regular season. Weber to Hoffman to Suzuki. Suzuki gets hit. Hoffman gets hit. Oh, there's a scrum out front. Skinner able to break it out of the zone. There you go, Skin. Shoot. No. Fuck. All right. Hits off the stick. No good. Mike Hoffman to Joe Armia. Now to Weber. Weber shot. Blocker save. Barely able to get a piece of that on the blocker. But good save nonetheless for Jake Allen. Sherratt out front. Shot wide again. Christian Dvorak now pinned. Pissick. Wide to Hinnestroza. Hinnestroza toe drags. Shot. Glove save. Carey Price. You know, it's every time that there's about to be a shot in which the screen just goes... Like, it's always when there's entertaining shit, it goes... It... <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. I don't know, man. Taking the face off. We win it. But Druin's able to intercept it before it gets to our defenseman. Nice jump off the draw. Druin losing it now. Hag. Up to Thompson. Thompson to Coglia. Coglia tries to make a move, but he gets hit. Hinnestroza intercepting the Montreal Canadian breakout pass. Out front, Drew in, stick lifted. Battle down low. Thompson and Drew in trying to get that puck. No support. Coglia shot. Rebound. Thompson out front. Rebound again. There's no crashing, though. There is no crashing on their part. Pushing it back into the Montreal Canadian zone. Kulik for Armia. Armia to Kulik again. Still pressured in the Montreal Canadiens zone. Look at this four check by the Buffalo Sabres. Peralt now in the corner looking for someone trying to cut out front. Yokoharu going to hit him off. Asplund to Middlestat. Middlestat back to Asplund who mishandles the puck. Drew in. Going to take advantage of that. To Lekkonen. Lekkonen skating in. Shot blocked. Petri shot blocked. Ooh, Lekkonen shot blocked again. Buffalo wants it, man. Buffalo fucking wants it. What are you doing, 8-8? Eight, eight. What the fuck was that out front? What the fuck was that out front? Lekkonen to Byron. Byron, backhand shot. Yokoharu. Yokoharu battling for it. Uh-oh. Buffalo's having a hard time getting it out of the zone. Petrie. Still with it. Just allowing him to skate in. Lekkonen shot out front wide open. And it's a save. Rebound, though. Petrie back up to Byron. Byron slap shot blocked. Lekin into Byron. Byron out front. Block shot again by Hina Shroza. And they're just going to dump it down the length of the ice for an icing. Just trying to get some kind of change in momentum. Montreal really getting some offensive pressure on us there. They got their fourth line out who is dead tired. Montreal's fourth line is dead tired. There's our first line who is full Middle stat is our center on the first line? What the fuck happened? And it shows it a Yokoharu. Yokoharu. Wide pass misses. Slon T no good. Yokoharu. Still with it. Over to Hag. Hag over to Hinnestroza. To Yokoharu. To Asplin. Asplin gets absolutely obliterated along the boards and slow getting up. Still gonna play it though. Minish. Middle stat to Hinnestroza. Again, slow getting up his middle stat. Holy shit. Gallagher. Hits it up. To middle stat. Middle stat in our zone. Yokoharu. We're just skating backwards. I don't know what happened, but this is a different Buffalo Sabres team than I just watched the first half of this game. 
We look like a bunch of idiots now out on that ice. No four check happening. Where it looks like we're trying to play like conservative right now. Like we're playing for a tie. Gallagher pinned. Five seconds remaining. Kulik, big hit. Middle stack gets hit too. And that's gonna do it for the end of the second period. Score is two to two. I gotta check injuries. I gotta check injuries. Uh Is there any injuries here? No, it's not gonna tell me there. Fuck. Uh, crap, 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 crap. What if we go here? No, I'm not gonna tell me if they're hurt. All right, it's not gonna tell me if they're hurt, that's fine. That's fine. Shots are 16 to 8 us. Boys, we need to come out firing here. All right? I need us to come out firing. All right, so no injuries. It was just a weird first line combination. I guess things got mixed up following the penalty. Eichel to Edmondson to Toffoli. Toffoli losing to Olofsson. Olofsson skating it in. Kind of eyeing to cut to the middle and a big hit by the Montreal Canadiens. I don't know what it is with Buffalo trying to walk things in. They need to be getting some more shots. The fully high glove save by Jake Allen. <sighs> Allen's been playing amazing. Our defense has been really good. And we've had a lot of offensive pressure. <sighs> but ever since that penalty got killed by Montreal, it, it really feels like Montreal has been in charge of that goal. To fully save. To fully up to Petrie. Petrie losing it. Svechnikov over to Darlene. Darlene. Over to Olofsson. Olofsson skating. Trying to find something or someone. He gets hit. Galchenyuk now with it. Dump it down low, Gally. Dump it down low. Oh, Gallagher to Eichel. Eichel, pass out front. Intercepted by Darlene. Darlene to Skinner. Let's go. Skinner. Skating it in. Getting time. Skates to the middle. Shot low and wide. Galchenyuk over to Anderson. Shot. Too high. We got to hit the net, boys. We're not going to score if we can't hit the net. Here we go. There's that Buffalo pressure. There's that Buffalo pressure. Boom. Outwork him. Mike Hoffman still with the puck, but God, he got hit like three times. Gall Gallagher, toe drag, losing it. Wide to Edmondson. Edmondson to Hoffman. Shot right into the chest of Jake Allen for a defensive zone faceoff for Buffalo. Uh okay, 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 okay. All right. Skinner. Up to Anderson. Anderson. Look in, look in. Out front. No good. Nick Suzuki. Been rather quiet today. Haven't seen much of him. Mike Hoffman. Hit along the boards, losing the puck. Cousins. He gets hit off the, off the puck, too. Anderson's back to Cousins. Dump it, dump it, dump it. You fucking idiot. Come on. Suzuki to Hoffman. Hoffman trying to dump it into the zone, but that one gets blocked. And here it goes the other way. Into Shroza. Up to Pissick. Pissick. Really high shot. I mean, Price could have let that one go over with ease, but he decides that he wants to uh, cover it, get some corral. Yeah, not corral, you know. No, no, no. Control. He wanted to get some control under this game. That was team to reset here. Third line versus third line. We win it. Shot block there. Weber. Up to Armia. Armia losing it. Hit a Caglia. That is why there's an injured Montreal. It's four on five. Not going to happen until they hold or touch the puck. Who is it? Is that Drew in? Joel Armia gets hurt. Big hit. He gets spun around like... Oh, he got spun. You don't like to see an injury of any player, but it happens. It does happen. Hopefully, this doesn't lead Montreal to rally around his cause. Thompson losing it. Sherratt wide to Weber. Weber over to Lekkonen. Lekkonen losing it to Thompson. Thompson to Hinnestroza out front. Hits the post. 
Hinnis Shroza hits the post. Pissick to Thompson to Butcher. Butcher down low to Coglia. Coglia skating, saucing it over to Pissick. Pissick to Butcher. Butcher skates it right into the same Montreal Canadian who hit Pissick. And Pissick, I don't, I don't know what's happening here. We don't, we don't got that great of uh, movement once we have the puck. Hinnis Shroza trying to cut to the middle. Sherratt, pucks loose. Weber. Up to Lekkonen. Lekkonen wide. Wide. He gets hit. Coglia. Coglia, come on. There you go. Stay with it, buddy. Stay with it. Wide to Pissick. Over to Hinnestroza, who couldn't corral the puck again. Jonathan drew in now. Coming on in. Over to Shira, who gets hit. And here we go. Two on one. Well, it's more of a two on two. They're going to dump it into the zone. Savar getting chased. He puts it off the boards. Dvorak coming back for the regroup on the reverse. Savar to Drew in. Drew in. Coming on in. He gets hit out front. Back up to Savar. Savar losing it to Asplin. Asplin now skating and he dumps it on in. I don't know why he had so much space. Suzuki. Big hit. Middle stand out front. Get poked by Carey Price. Buck goes around to Sharat. Sharat getting pressured. Off the boards to Caulfield. Caulfield pinned into his own zone. Back to Sherratt to Suzuki. Suzuki to Gallagher. Gallagher to Savard. Come on, poke. Get it. Get that puck, man. Gallagher. Just kind of standing there behind the net. Off the boards to Svechnikov. Svechnikov. Losing it. Sherratt. Over to Druin. Over to Eichel. Eichel between the legs, trying to make some fancy moves. Losing it. Jake Allen plays it out front and intercepted by a Montreal Canadian. Gallagher out front to Foley. 1T out front. Save. Olofsson. Passing it up to Svechnikov. He's getting chased down. Svechnikov over to Olofsson. To Galchenyuk. Shooting it on the side of the net. No good. Olofsson with it. Still with it. Losing it to Sherratt. Now back up to Eichel. Eichel. One on one. Cuts to the middle, shot, save, looking for that rebound. But Buffalo able to get it out. Cousins now, three on two, but they're too slow. Cousins, get rid of the fucking puck, man. We need to stop just skating into their sticks. To Foley, to Caulfield, Caulfield. We just let them skate in like that. Like, they're just skating in, and then we got our guys who are like, oh, I'm scared of the blue line. I'm scared of that blue line. Here we go, Cousins. Take a shot, Cousins. Take a fucking shot. <sighs> All right. So it looks like we're on a team full of people who just are, are scared. Oh, <gasps> Skinner. 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 Oh. High glove save by Price. 23 seconds left. 23 seconds remaining. Here we go. We lose it. Edmondson. No pressure at all by Buffalo. Edmondson literally just glides out of the zone. Asplund dumping it into the zone. Four check coming. Petrie. He gets pinned. Battle still down low. Pucks loose. Bjork. Five seconds. Bjork. Fucking get something going. Middle step. Shot. Oh my god. This fucking team, man. Oh, I'm gonna have I'm gonna strangle all of them. I really want to strangle fucking Xbox right now for how bad this fucking quality right now is. Every time there's something important going on is when the screen wants to go err. Like holy shit! There it is again. Like it does it for no real reason. Like stop trying to change the fucking graphics then. How about that? Stop trying to change the goddamn graphics every five fucking seconds. Three-on-three three play now here in overtime. Petrie out front to Eichel. Save by Allen. <sighs> Galchenyuk and Olafson are out there for us. They got Eichel into Foley. Winning it back to Darlene. Get some space, Darlene. Fuck. Dumping it into the zone. Could have dumped that a lot sooner when your forwards had more momentum going into the zone. So they got to stop and glide all along the blue line. Over to Eichel. Eichel slap shot. Save by Allen. 
Dude, we're playing like a bunch of pussies. Like, are you guys playing to tie? Like, that's what it feels like our team's doing. Like, Montreal's playing to win. Buffalo's just playing to tie. Darlene, over to Olofsson. Victor Olofsson coming in. Over to Galchenik to Darlene. Darlene shot saved by the blocker of Carey Price and hit out of play. <sighs> Offensive zone faceoff. Let's go. Galchenyuk lining up against Eichel still. Galchenyuk losing the faceoff. Petrie pinned down low. Let's get some pressure, boys. Pressure. There you go. Galchenyuk down low. Intercepted. You could have just fucking shot that shit. You should have just fucking shot it. Eichel pushed around the boards to Petrie. Petrie, he gets hit off the puck. Darlene. Skating it. Get some separation. Holy fuck. What are you doing? Standing right in front of Darlene. He's trying to fucking skate. Eichel pinned in the corner. Three of our guys now are in that corner. Olafson. Come on. Oh my god. Gallagher. To Olafson again to Darlene. Darlene over to Galchenyuk. Holy fuck. Stop standing a straight line. That was so fucking bad. That was so bad, Buffalo. That was horrific. Horrific. That is the worst hockey I have probably ever seen at the end of that game. It literally, all the way up until the 10-minute mark in the second half. All the way up to the 10-minute mark of the second quarter, you guys were doing Phenomenal. I thought we were going to win. We had pressure. We were forechecking. We were getting the puck. We were causing it. And then, I don't know what happened, but everyone on our fucking team was like, huh, you know what? Let's just do a little dump and chase, and we'll act like we're on the PK for the entire fucking game. The entire game. What the fuck? Is it going to let me rewind? Is the instant replay really glitched so I can't go back and watch? Oh my god. Instant replays. Alright, found the first glitch. Instant replay doesn't even fucking work. Replays do not work. You guys can hear me hitting every fucking button. Here, let's go. Back in instant replay. RT, LT. Uh, let's see. Right stick, left stick. D-pad for zoom, height, hide. Oh, we can hide. We can hide. We just can't move. I can't even go back and break down how fucking awful that game, like the, that, that, especially the overtime was. You had Shea fucking Weber come in and dangle the fuck out of your goaltender. That's how bad your fucking breakout was. And that was our top three fucking players. Oh my god, guys. Gotta do better. We gotta do better. Fuck.